Well, hello, good afternoon, everybody. We should be uh, up and away in a few moments with our coverage, which I'm sure will be a fascinating game. There is an added sense of drama provided by the elements, actually. The rain has once more decided to appear at this most inopportune of moments, and it is heavy rain. It does not dampen the atmosphere. The turnout here is good, the noise is very good. It remains colourful, but it could be a problem for the players because the pitch might very quickly turn heavy. We'll see as it all plays out over the next couple of hours here. It is a venue, this, which simply adds to the spectacle of the game it stages. One of the most impressive arenas in this part of the world. Russia have gone with a 4-5-1, Jim. Well, it's a formation, Peter, that lends itself to good possession and control in midfield because you've got the numbers there, a higher concentration. Backing that up with enough attacking dynamism is down to managers who want to get at teams. It can be used in cautious terms too, but certainly if you want to advance a little quicker and you have that attitude, then you can be very positive about this too. got things on the way so Jim tell me this who are you looking for in particular here yeah Christian Eriksen he's super accurate with both feet Peter and able to deliver a cross or a through ball with just the perfect bend or indeed weight all this allied to great awareness and vision which make him a massive creative talent what I really like about Eriksen though is that he's got the energy and the determination to keep going for 90 minutes every game He's a trier. I'm not thinking the same. He will be a central feature, no doubt. Great strength, too strong for his opponent. Well, the crowd clearly liked what they just saw. Some real no-nonsense defending. Gets the better of his man. That's just very well played. He can't hurt you with his back to goal and he didn't go for the back heel. Just brushed off the ball there. Golovin. It's been a rather gentle affair so far. There's a long ball. Poulsen. Denmark have made it clear what they're trying to do for me, Peter. What are they trying to do? Well, I think they're making the pitch as big as possible to work both flanks into, into better supply routes. It's a very good battle there, terrific to watch. More than happy to take the muscular approach. Jikia drives it towards the front. Juba, Golovin, gorgeous control there, gets up to head it, goal, Russia! Russia are really pouncing on any straight passes in midfield, we're talking seconds from interception to the back of the net, it's counter-attacking heaven. Russia draw first blood here. 
Yeah, and they know there's plenty of work left in this one, Peter, before they can actually say that the job is over. And the referee's awarded a free kick. Well, that looks like a final warning. Still no card. Hoists it forward. Oh, that's clearly not what he wanted to do. Tries lifting it over. Has a goal! Forward it goes. And it's played forward. And no, that is pretty much the end of that. And here's Cheryshev. Juba. Golovin. Golovin clips one through. Goes for goal. They scored! And already they're looking to run away with it. Perfect place, but the one place the keeper couldn't reach. Well, you know, sometimes it pays off not to think too much about things, just put your foot through it and... That was a good example, great contact, and the keeper had very little chance. So that's two now without reply. Well, they're very much the better team at the moment, Peter, and, and no doubt we'll be looking to, to cause even more damage here. He gets past his man. Balls loose, who's getting there? Kutryashov gets rid without sophistication. Pulsen. Russia are ahead here. It has been a good half for them. Gets it back. Tries to get it forward quickly. Gets away from his opponents. He's one on one, surely! Kasper Schmeichel, very firm in standing his ground there. It is a tough full contact contest. Golovin goes looking, now a chance to break. Plays it out to the wing. Going through. Massively! <laughs> they are rampant! All too easy! They are in danger of disappearing out of sight! Yeah, looking back at that, that's how you play on the counter. Quick and decisive and ruthless with the finish. I thought it was a stunning, stunning breakaway. Russia take a three-goal lead, and they are romping out of sight. Well, it's been a, an absolutely fabulous spell for them, and they're starting to look unstoppable. There could be more on the way. Well, that's a foul. Simple decision for the referee. Christensen. And here's Ericsson. Tries a shot! And it's the whistle for half-time. 
Well, there's plenty that can be said about the last 45 minutes, but one thing that cannot be said is that it's dull. One-sided, yes, but packed with excitement. Peter, do I really need to say anything, or can I simply refer you to the scoreline? Russia, three goals to the good after a really excellent first half that's been intriguing to watch. Plenty of highlights to show you during the break. And we are underway again. Scherner. Who's he going to play in? And it's Eriks. Golovin battles to win it back. It's being played forward. Uh, needed a better pass there. Delaney. Hoists it forward. Back into the middle. Out to the right. needed better contact. Oh, look, I don't want to sound too dismissive, but from here, that looks the harder thing to do. Wilson. Gets into a dangerous position. Delaney. Nil the score, and very little to suggest that much is going to change. Tries to get it forward quickly, and now the breakaway. <laughs> Could cross it here. Keepers in command. Paulson. Paul's gone out of play. Cheneshev. So who's he picking out? Denmark have just about everyone back and central. Yeah, clearly they're trying to show strength to what the opposition have seen as a weakness. It's a safety first approach. Poulsen. Juba. Well, they could break here. Hit into the middle, hits it first time! It goes to show he is human after all. Oh, no, that was a chance. What a chance. Oh, now some movement on the bench, and we are going to see a change. Turner. Delaney. And it's played forward. Knocks it away. It's a throw in. A couple of changes then in quick succession. Yeah, he's run himself into the ground, hasn't he? And it's, it's good to see that the crowd appreciate his efforts because he has put in a real honour shift. Ball's come loose, and the chase is on. Good challenge, he just stood firm. Delaney is fouled. Away from immediate danger. It's a 
great gallop down the right-hand side. Oh, that's nice. Puts in a cross. Oh, that's not going to find its target. That's a throw. But there's going to be another change here. Yeah, it's pretty obvious as to who was going to be taken off. His energy levels began to, to sag, and he was never going to last until the final whistle. He's got options in the box if he gets his head up. Pumps it into the area. And that has been cleared. Ericsson. Ericsson gives chase. And out to safety. Hoiberg. It's a loose ball. Just brushed off the ball there. Chance to break. Out to the left it goes. Cheryshev. He's got away. Shoots! Oh, top draw save from the keeper. Poulsen. And a bit of in. And it's Cheryshev. Nicely controlled. Good. He's gone for it! Great football, shot and save. it right Shona and that's that Great day for attacking football, the artists have painted their pretty pictures. Only one team in it. How do you sum up what we've witnessed, Jim? Russia will walk away happy from this with 